Write a YouTube video intro for a video about using AI to generate a stock trading strategy. Hello and welcome to our channel. In today's video, we will be discussing how to use AI to generate a stock trading strategy. This is an exciting topic, as AI has the potential to help us make more informed and profitable decisions when it comes to trading stocks. This is ChatGPT from OpenAI. It is artificial intelligence brought to the consumer. You can ask this AI to do a lot of things for you, such as write you YouTube intros, but it can also do code for you, which is amazing value as it pertains to day trading. In this video, you're going to see me sort of discover how to use this. You're actually going to get an artificially intelligence created coded strategy, and then I plug that strategy into think or swim and run some of my own back testing against it so this is kind of a discovery of this artificial intelligence tool and how it can bring us value as traders if you're interested in this video make sure you interact with it leave a like leave a comment and if this video tends to get some traction maybe we can dive deeper into this kind of ai trading strategy creation in the future but for now let's get into the topic hey trading trading is artificial intelligence Yo, let's uh let's get into trading. Wait. Uh write a uh JavaScript uh automated This is gonna I'm asking a lot. Let's see what this does to this though. Automated trading, uh automated stock trading. Do you all see my mind just explode? So this just gave you something. I have a trading bot chat. Well, this is getting me trade data. What's it selling based off of? Does it have, does it have like, did it build a strategy into this? If quote latest price. Oh, 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 oh. You have to just give it, you give it what stock you want it to look at. And then you give it what price you want to buy and what price you want to sell. So no, it didn't it didn't really give it a strategy. Imagine, imagine chat GPT like just put a whole ass like working strategy in here. Uh implement a uh trading. See if we can make it do it. See if we can make it give us a strategy. Is this just writing the same thing? Oh, no. Oh, shit. <laughs> it's adding some moving averages in. Hold. If the 50-day moving average is greater than the 200 moving average and the uh, quote price is under the 50-day moving average, buy. Uh-oh. Chat, chat GPT, our AI chat just gave us a trade strategy, chat. So let's... uh. I want to backtest this. Hold on. You guys want to? Do you guys want to take the time to backtest this? It'll take me like five minutes. I can write this code in ThinkScript real quick. Fifty-day moving average greater than two hundred-day moving average and uh, close is under fifty-day moving average. Buy. Let's do it. Let's do it real quick. We got. We got a. Uh, we got an AI. AI just wrote us a trading strategy. Let's see if it works. He's using day moving average, so I assume it's on the daily chart. Uh, let me save my quad box. Oh, fuck. I didn't save it. I hit the wrong button. Whatever. Too late now. Uh, let's go here. Let's go. Uh, well, first off, let's go here. Um, let's go to daily. Let's go to studies. Let's go to remove this one. Let's go to remove this one. Let's add, uh, it just says 200 day moving average. I assume that means simple moving average then. One, two, I just need two. I need a uh, 50 and I need a 200, uh, different color, obviously. Um, all right, let's write a quick strategy. Give me like this. Give me a template. Uh, okay. Actually, this is a way too complicated template. I don't need any of this. Uh, okay. 
get my template set up real quick. Uh, we're not shorting at all, so I don't need any of that. Um, wait, what is this? Define buy. So the AI wants us to buy when the 50 day is over the 200 day and the last price is below the 50 day. So uh, simple moving average uh, equals 50 is greater than that same thing. Grid. Let's test this AI's code chat. Uh, and close is less than this. All right, now just give me this. So this is really simple, obviously. This, and I think I just reverse everything. Say what it is I see. What did I break? Uh, what did I break? Invalid statement define at two one. I don't know what I broke. I don't know. I don't know what happened, but we fixed it. <laughs> um, AI strategy. All right. See if it works. I mean, to be fair, when you run, when you run anything against spy, when you run any bullish strategy against spy, it's going to make money, right? Uh, what are we doing this on? 50 shares. So 50 shares from uh, 44 to 379. What's 379 minus 44? That's 335. 335 times 50. So the buy and hold strategy is up 16,008. No, wait, sorry. 168,000. Wait, is that? That's not right. That's not right. I did something wrong. Hold. I did something wrong. Uh, 45. No, wait, wait, wait. Three. Four oh seven minus 45. 362. 362. I put an extra decimal. Times 50. So the buy and hold strategy, if you just had 50 shares over this time frame, is up 18.1. This strategy is up 17.6. So it's not winning, but it's not bad. For, for an artificial intelligence telling me the strategy, it's not bad. So it's really just buying uh, below the 50 MA if the 50 MA is also above the 200 MA and then selling when it crosses back above the 50 MA. If that MA is also below the 200. Wow, that's actually, uh, that's actually very interesting. This is obviously not a winning strategy because it underperforms buy and hold, which is important. You need it to overperform buy and hold. Um, except that the difference is when you have a trading strategy like this, you can scale it, right? So when you won this trade here, you obviously increased your bank account by uh, two and a half grand. You can then use that extra two and a half grand in this trade, which increased your bank account by a couple hundred bucks. And you can then use that you know, $2,900 that you're up now in this trade. So you wouldn't just buy 50 flat the whole time. And if you're doing that, then you definitely would outperform the S&P with this strategy. Wow. Thank you. Uh, thank you, uh, AI.